Independent candidate Sun Xu Yu was defeated in the Taipei's legislative by-election yesterday by just 9,000 votes. It's a thin margin, but observers note that her defeat spells trouble for her biggest supporter, Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe. It's widely believed that Ke plans to run for president in 2020. Critics say Sunday saw him losing an election in his own backyard, a sign of his diminishing prospects in a national race. The day after the election, Taipei's mayor appeared calm and collected as he discussed his candidate's defeat. Actually, even if she had succeeded, we would still have to write an evaluation report. The only thing is that a report on her defeat has to be longer. It's no big deal. I saw the polls before the elections and the outcomes were similar. I don't think this election has anything to do with whether I will or won't form a political party. Ko was mum on whether he would form his own party ahead of the 2020 elections. But observers say that Sunday's result is a setback for a potential presidential bid. Although Ko could build momentum with his upcoming U.S. visit or by forming a party, his road to the presidency is looking bumpy. Today, if Ko Wenzhe were to call on his army and his protégés across Taiwan to run for legislator, he would encounter some problems. I don't think the public will go for candidates who parachute into an electoral district, riding on the mayor's coattails. The by-election outcome might be a warning to Ke on his road to the presidency. These councillors expect Ke to run in 2020, but they say that in the wake of Sunday's by-election, the mayor will have to rethink his strategies.